Calendar. Welcome to this player growth test. I'll be taking a look at Nabi Keita here. The 20 year old center mid, he just has a 72 overall. Some really good base stats, especially physically. Uh, he just felt really agile. Uh, he was able to dominate the midfield for me at times. Uh, just, you know, being such a good two way midfielder as well. But a 5 foot 8 center mid size CDM was right foot, high medium work rates, 3 star weak foots, and 2 star skill moves. So you can see again uh, some really good agility, acceleration, sprint speed, solid balance, stamina are very good as well. Nice to have that type of stamina because uh you know with that pace uh you know it's solid pace you can really just kind of burst up and down the pitch uh and win the ball back for you and uh certainly push forward as well but uh at the end of that first uh season up to the 74 overall some good boost physically uh some incre incremental improvement technically but mental stats really improved a lot throughout which you will see the vision and interceptions are already in the dark green uh and that's really impressive at this say aggression at the 80 mark attack vision at 70 as well ball control dribbling very solid and the short pass Passing and shot power aren't too bad either uh, as he really just continued to grow physically also uh, which was really good to see as he just turned into an absolutely beast of a player for me uh, throughout and you'll see especially see that in the highlights but uh, 78 overall age 23 uh, some more incremental improvement to the technical stats but the mental stats were the main uh, areas in those first few years that seemed to improve uh, but you'll see the dribbling at the 82 mark now again bodes well for being a two-way midfielder uh, the short passing long passing are, are very good also but uh, can certainly put in a good tackle as well. Doesn't have the best marking or slide tackling, but uh, can certainly do a job for you if needed. So he scored some goals for me as well. Uh, you'll see the goals first. Um, you know, just really could run at the defense. This run was really impressive. Uh, forces uh, the defender to make one of those silly little slide tackles, and eventually I was able to put the ball in the back of the net. Can certainly make those good runs uh, with the type of ball control dribbling, you know, the Jody and all that that he has. Had quite a few assists for me also. Uh, just a little simple pass, able to put it on a platter uh, to grab himself an assist on that highlights but uh, now moving forward you can certainly see uh, how agile he is uh, and he's able to again play a nicely weighted pass to grab himself another assist here so some good work from him uh, getting forward he can score goals he can uh, you know give an assist create goals as well uh, as you'll see here this run was incredible uh, it just played you know the wrong pass in the end uh, just a little bit too much on that one just really can run at the defenses like I said and create things but uh, he certainly has some solid passing also uh, solid long passing I mean because uh, you saw quite a few of the short passes were, were very solid you can also get into some tackles as you could see uh, in that highlights uh, and this run a uh, little track back was really impressive to me just running it uh, out, you know, from midfield, able to win the ball back and plays a really good ball forward as well. So uh, you can see he's a really good box-to-box -box type. He can play uh, probably even as a cam as well. You know, with that type of vision, he's not going to have the skill moves or anything. But he's very agile. Uh, he has great acceleration. Sprint speed is pretty solid. Very good balance as well. But uh, I do think his best position is going to be as a, a general center mid, uh, just give his ability to you know get forward, track back, do everything is needed as a box-to-box -box midfielder. Has a dribbler and playmaker specialties as well but uh he's 81 as a winger 83 as a center forward 84 as a cam 85 as a center mid 83 as a right mid left mid 81 as a cdm and 79 as a wing back even so uh, a very versatile player can play in numerous positions but i do think his best spot is going to be just as a general uh box to box cm who can really control the game he controlled the game so well for me uh you know with his ability to track back his pace uh his passing uh his ball control dribbling and he knows solid finishing as well it can certainly can score some some goals for you so uh with that guys a huge recommendation here i certainly would take a look at him but with that thanks for tuning in i'll be signing out now and i'll catch you guys later